obviously. These tattoos were too fancy though. I mean, they were all like little lines, sometimes crosses. But what's especially crazy is that Good afternoon. Welcome to my vlog. I don't know if I'm gonna keep saying that. I don't know if it's worth having a thing to say with how inconsistent I am with this. And in fact, I don't know. I might delete everything that I am behind on editing and just start here again instead. That's a shame but it seems to be within my nature. Anyways, just got off work, got some soda for the fam. Gonna go pick up the little one for Magic Monday, go home, shower, maybe go back over to my granny's again. I don't know. Work was okay today, except when I lost my battle trying to put the recycling bin back in its place. It's gigantic. It's, you know, one of those huge giant metal ones that like the garbage truck is supposed to move. So I couldn't get it back in place. And I was mad about that for like hours. I'm still a little mad about it. I'm just, I'm too small to move that thing. If the wheels on it actually turned, that would probably solve my whole problem, but the wheels are so like corroded, they don't even... I think if I keep talking about that recycling bin, I'll never stop being mad about it. <laughs> oh, I guess if I'm gonna delete everything else, um, I got bangs last Tuesday. They're supposed to be straight, but you know, I have curly hair, so they're not. Golly, I feel like it just took me like 20 minutes to get her car seat in the car. Colin came out and helped me. He came out and helped me put the car seat in. But then when I went to put the baby in the car seat later, it wouldn't tighten and I had to redo the whole thing. Frustrating, I'm very easily frustrated today. But I'm gonna try to stop that. Yeah, I'm back Tony, I'm welcome. And what? And pine cones on the bottom. Twenty one. Twenty one. Twenty one teeny tiny bit on it. Okay. I'll try to stop being so frustrated and Freya's only got one teeny tiny pine cone. So And then to top it all off, I mean that makes sense, right? Duh. So maybe they All right, another extremely part-time work week in the books. My day was fine. Let's see. Colin's mom sent me with some money for green beans. I don't know why I decided to show you. You can't tell, but there's green beans in that bag. Deep fried green beans, gluten-free, woohoo. And now it's time to head home because Grammy is alone with Freya. And Grammy does not have the energy to be alone with Freya, but Colin had to go do some work. So let's go home and rescue Grammy from the clutches of the terrible blood lord. Also, it's pretty nice out today. And what a rescue Grammy needed. Freya was pissed that her dad had to leave to go do some work for an hour. An hour, he was only gone an hour, but she was not happy with that because Mondays and Tuesdays are days that she gets to hang out with him. She was not happy that somebody else took daddy's time during her time. But he is home, that is settled. And now I can finally take my shower and wash all this burger grease out of my bangs. Not that it's gonna make them look any better. I still like them though. The camera's about to die. Yay! Yeah. It is not gonna happen.
House drama, builder drama. If you ever get into serious business with a friend, get a contract, write a contract. That's the lesson I'm learning right now with trying to get a house built. Visible in the camera. It's like a beautiful cloud or something. I really doubt you can see it. I do not feel like I had a lot of patience as a parent today. Toddlers can kind of be like jerks as roommates. I'm really not sure I recommend having an actual toddler as a roommate, so, you know, something to avoid if you can. But now, the day is at an end. Bedtime is upon us. I needed my phone charger, which is why I'm out here. It's been in my car, because my inside one broke. Tomorrow is a new day. A day where we can try again to get along. Today <clears throat> was indeed a new day, new opportunities to get along. Then like the first two things that my toddler decides to do to me this morning is pull my hair. And I say, don't pull my hair, pulls my hair again, and spits in my face. How am I supposed to get along with that? <sighs> Good morning. It's a new day. I'm the bigger person. I'm the adult. I don't need to hold crutches against a toddler. I do need to get downstairs with my family though. Uh, Colin wants to watch The Tenth Kingdom with me before he goes to bed today. Because we never get to hang out. And I'm up early enough. So. God, I hope she's nicer to me today. I don't think I can handle a mean toddler today. Well, I'm getting along better with Freya than I was yesterday, but I am actively making an enemy of the neighbor. I just went and yelled at him for a few minutes, waving a bag of dog shit around. We don't have a dog. I should not have a bag of dog shit to wave around. And mom gets hurt very easily and almost tripped all over trying not to step in that poop this morning. Giant dog in our yard that would not listen to her for her to try to get it back into its own yard and the owner is just, oh, sorry, sorry. Oh yeah, go ahead, pepper spray him. I'm scared of the dog too. Oh, so anyways, I'm heated because I'm like still, I'm like shaking from just, I don't like confrontation. That old man pisses me off so bad. <sighs> it's fine. I'm the angry crazy lady. I'm the angry crazy lady. It's fine. That's just who I am. I, I should just start embracing it. Stop trying to fight my violent nature. <laughs> It's just inconsiderate. It is inconsiderate for him to let his giant dog come in here and poop in our yard and we bring it up and he says that we should put a fence around both our yards together so that the dog has enough room to roam. No. No. If I wanted a dog in my yard, I would get a fucking dog. Oh, I think Colin's right. I need therapy or anger management. Mom wanted to wake me up this morning to go yell at the neighbor because she doesn't have the heart to do it. <laughs> so she was telling me that when I first came downstairs. I said, oh, do you want me to go do that now? And Colin said, maybe not now, because he wanted to watch The Tenth Kingdom with me. And he said, if you, go, if you go do that now, you won't be able to enjoy the show with me, because you're going to get all mad. And I said, well, what if 
it's like a release and I feel better. I get it out of my system. And he said, you don't operate that way. That's not how you operate. And I said, yeah, no, you're right. I just kind of like dig myself a pit and stay there. <sighs> I just stay mad, you know? I don't know how to let things go. I don't want to punish the dog. It's not the dog's fault. I want the old man to stop encroaching on our space. To stop taking advantage. I don't know. That guy just rubs me the wrong way. I should go back inside and help Ma. I think she's simmering up some cayenne. In case she has to try to get that dog out of our yard again. That's a coffee filter. I didn't know what to do. Mom. So I got beans here, got some like dirt soup here, some like leaf soup over here, Kool-Aid here. I died of my toy. <laughs> At her garden shop. It's pretty nice. You need help. You do? With picking the beans you said? Yep. All right, I'll help you pick beans for a bit. So how did your sauce turn out, Grammy? Should I try it or I no? I haven't tasted it yet. Okay. Oh, welcome back, guys. How was square dancing? sure I would ever be interested in finding out how much money and gas I spend driving around to put that one to sleep. It's probably a lot. 